The world of football doesn't end with matches, and it is much more interesting to watch the stars of our favorite game outside the football pitch. What are their habits? What are they buying? What is going on in their lives anyway? You could agree with the fact that it is sometimes boring to discuss football fixtures only. In fact, everything becomes a bit dull and familiar, and there are not so many really bombastic events given. Therefore, different super leagues appear because of our boredom and insufficient attention to football. Alright, we continue to cover the lives of football stars for you, and in today's issue we have Georgina Rodriguez's unexpected reaction to Messi's family, who Holland and Mbappe follow on Instagram, Conor McGregor wants to buy Manchester United, Netflix is filming a show about Cristiano Ronaldo's fiancé, and many, many other interesting information awaits us. Are you ready? Let's get going then! Firstly, we are to start with the fun part. Georgina Rodriguez must have raged Cristiano Ronaldo with her act. What happened? Let's take a look. On the 5th of April, Barcelona hosted Valladolid in La Liga, and Leo Messi received a commemorative t-shirt from the management of the club before the match in honor of the big event. The Argentine performed the largest number of games for the Blaugranas. The wife of the captain of the Kules, Antonella Rakutze, posted four photos of her, Leo and the kids on Instagram. What did Ronaldo's fiancé do? She put a heart in the comments. Is that how she reacted to Messi's record? If so, then Ronaldo has definitely told Georgina everything he thinks on that. Well, we are joking, of course. In fact, this story once again proves that Georgina is very sympathetic to Antonella. Remember how she reacted to Messi's wife post for Tiago's birthday? If not, we will recall you. How quickly they grow, wrote Ronaldo's chosen one under the post and gained many likes and approving comments. What is new with Messi off the pitch? According to Rock One, Antonella is looking for a new home. The most interesting part of the news lies in the fact that the main name for the couple is the house in the village. Messi will live in the village, can you imagine that? In fact, everything is pretty luxurious. Messi's wife is looking for a house in a small seaside village of Jaraf, located between Sieges and Castell de Fels. These are the areas of Barcelona, therefore Catalan fans hardly have to doubt and fear these days. It seems that Messi is happy again. Barca won the cup, the club is a contender to win La Liga, and on the pitch Leo is in very good shape. Messi is also doing well off the games. Lionel's hotels opened up with some unusual updates. The hotel in Ibiza will provide its clients with a constellation effect pool, which will allow you to listen to the DJ while being underwater. It is also noted that its new LED fiber optic lightning will create a unique atmosphere on summer nights. The hotel in Mallorca will feature a completely renovated and refurbished facade, giving it a more Mediterranean character as well as an impressive spa from which you can watch the sunset. Less visible changes have also been made, all to cope with environmental concerns and efforts to reduce unwanted air emissions. As a result, the US Green Building Council awarded them the prestigious LEED seal, which is awarded to eco-friendly buildings. MIM Ibiza received the gold category, and MIM Mallorca received the silver award, becoming the first hotel in Spain to have such a title. In general, Messi's affairs in the hotel business are pretty successful. Keep it up, Leo! We are back to the family of Ronaldo. We will soon be able to see Cristiano on Netflix. The thing is that Georgina Rodriguez starred in her own reality show, which covers the girls' everyday life, so it is possible that the Portuguese will also take part in the shooting. What will this series be called? That's one of purely original naming. You will never guess. Come on! Ok, we give up. The series will be called Georgina. This reality show will be a deep and emotional portrait of a woman, hidden behind photographs, stories and big headlines. Her daily life, her motherhood, her ups and downs. Says the description of the series. On Instagram, the girl didn't skimp on emotions about this. I'm very excited and happy with this new project. Thank you, family. It seems Ronaldo really loves Georgina very much, since he allowed Netflix, at least partially but, to show their personal lives. By the way, if we talk about Cristiano's football deeds, 
then his comeback to Real will not take place next summer. Florentino Perez completely ruled out such a possibility. According to the last info, Krish is going to epically return to Manchester United, to Old Trafford, where the owner may change very soon. And this owner can become Conor McGregor, who absolutely doesn't need any introduction. Hey guys, I'm thinking about buying Manchester United. What do you think? Wrote McGregor on Twitter. This was done in the midst of the hype involving the Super League, the withdrawal of English clubs from the newly created tournament, and rumors about the possible sale of the club by the current owners, the Glazer family. Therefore, Connor chose the perfect timing. The bustle was guaranteed to him. Because in reality, the odious UFC fighter has no chance of acquiring the Red Devils. Manchester United is valued at $4.2 billion and Connor has never been on the list of billionaires. His only chance is to find investors or buy part of the club shares, as LeBron James did in Liverpool, whose dream is to transfer Kylian Mbappe to Anfield. By the way, about the star of PSG, the other day it became known to which football players and show business stars Mbappé has signed. There are no PSG footballers on the list, since Kylian is obviously subscribed to them. So, let's go! Ronaldo, Ibrahimovic, Messi, Holland, Ramos, Salah, Van Dijk, Trent, Azar, Rashford, Sterling, Sancho, Miller, James, Modric, Aguero, De Jong, De Ligt, Aubameyang, Rooney, Totti, Buffon, Casillas, Drogba, Gerard, Dani Alves, Ronaldinho and Eto'o. It is immediately clear who the French top striker respects. Among the stars of the show business, Mbappe is subscribed to Wonder Woman Gal Gadot, Ariana Grande and Selena Gomez. Apparently, Killian is quite sympathetic to American beauties. Among the stars of other sports, the PSG forward is subscribed to Usain Bolt and Rafael Nadal. Quite a solid choice, too. As for Erling Holland, he has an extremely interesting list of subscriptions in terms of continuing his career. In his subscriptions you can find Lionel Messi, Barcelona, Robert Lewandowski, Bayern, Phil Foden, Manchester City, Sergio Ramos, Real Madrid, Kylian Mbappe, PSG and Virgil van Dijk, Liverpool. Apparently the Norwegian is considering six options. Zlatan Ibrahimovic will be another hero of the issue who is about to play in movies. He will be starring in the new part of the Asterix and Obelix franchise, Asterix and Obelix, The Middle Kingdom. The 39-year-old footballer will play a character named Antivirus, as he announced on his Instagram. The movie is scheduled to premiere in 2022. It also stars the actors Vincent Cassel, Marion Cotillard and Gilles Lelouch. Earlier in the franchise, famous athletes have already played in some roles. Michael Schumacher, Zinedine Zidane, Tony Parker, Jean Todt and Amélie Marasmo. Well, and this is it for now. We hope that you were interested throughout the entire video and you will give us a like and subscribe to the channel. Well, it was Inside Football. We watch football from a different angle. Have a nice one and see you in a bit.